barbershop conversation, guys. Feel free. Hit the subscribe button, man. It's going down September 28th in my city. Roll my protection. <laughs> Who gonna die next? Ain't trying to get elected. Hey! That's that's the song I cut off before I got up. Before I, uh... Block for me, black man! You know they trying to stretch us. AB calls out Keith Thurman. September 28th is going down. It's going down like the strippers on the pole, man. We, I'm a, y'all, check in if you come. If y'all want to do a dinner at my crib, I told y'all we can do it, and uh, we can do it at my business partner's house. We can do it at my house. I have a beautiful property in Malibu. We can do it there. It don't matter, but Malibu is a little bit too far for all y'all niggas that don't know the city because you're gonna get lost going up that fucking hill. But anyways, man, we gonna have a great time. September 28th, the weekend of September, September. It's going down, baby. But let's talk about AB. AB, all about business. AB, self-promotion. AB, he's taking all of Keith Thurman's media equity right now by saying, I'm willing to fight him. Let's settle our beef. I love it. Adrian Brona know he has a fight coming up, which is smart. Start promoting your fight, getting your name out there. Why not call out Keith Thurman? It can't happen next, right? But why not? And, uh, and you guys know how savvy Adrian Broner is. He, you, you're born with the ability to do this. Adrian Broner is born with the ability to do what he does. You know, uh, uh, he's gotten distracted along the way, obviously, as we know. But uh, Adrian Broner, the greatest self-promoter in boxing today since Floyd Mayweather has retired. You know what I mean? He, he said, let's settle our beef. Let's fight. That fight can't happen till next year. Adrian Broner's fighting Ivan Redcash. You know what I mean? So uh, it's going to be exciting. It's going to be fun. And uh, I can't wait. So uh, anyways, man, that's what it is. It's, I, I'm just excited. The tickets officially went on sale today at 12 o'clock noon for Earl Spence. For Earl Spence versus Sean Porter, man. Get there. Show up. Show out. We, let, can we sell out? Can we break Deontay Wilder's record for this fight? That's all I'm asking. Can we break Deontay Wilder's record for this fight? And then Deontay Wilder comes back and breaks Earl Spence's record. Can we do that, please? Can we do that? Can we show up and show out for my city? I'm going to do my part. I'm putting a few thousand dollars away for that week. All right? Uh, I, I, I've been in contact with my grandmas. All the grandmas and my, <laughs> you know, my mom and, and uh, uh, Dre's mom. I need y'all this week to watch the kids. All right? So I'm going to be, I'm going to have... I'm going to be very accessible, all right? I live five miles from the airport. Anybody need a ride? I got two Teslas. It seats 12 people total. We can do whatever. You know what I mean? We can have a great time. One of y'all niggas drive the other Tesla, and we'll be good as gold. You know what I mean? Uh, I have three cars. You know, I have the Honda, too, so... <laughs> we'll give Dre the Honda for a few days. <laughs> but anyways, man, I, I, I'm just excited to host y'all. Adrian Broner is being Adrian Broner, and I fucking love it. Start, let's promote the sport of boxing. At the end of the day, let's promote the sport of boxing. Adrian, Adrian Broner, and, and, and now the, the question is, could, would you ask me, is can Adrian Broner beat Keith Thurman? The Keith Thurman that I saw on the DS was a Keith Thurman that I've never ever seen before. The Keith Thurman uh, that I saw in the when he got hit in the when he two times in that fight when he got hit in the face and, and he stood still i've never seen that keith thurman before the keith thurman i got hit with a body shot and literally froze up he fought back and didn't go down i i humbly respect that but i've never seen that those emotions out of him before you know you know what i mean so i don't know who keith thurman is july 22nd you understand what i'm saying hopefully he, he comes back strong but do i think he can Adrian Broner can beat him. What we're not giving Adrian Broner credit for, we got these seven day, these Mormons and shit slowing down traffic on their bike. Who, why the fuck would you want to be a fucking Mormon? Why would you want to be a Mormon? It don't make sense. Like, I, I'm not discredit, but you can't drive a car for four years. You gotta. <laughs> Man, religious be handicapping the hell out of people and they just fall right into it. Oh my god, nigga cross the street over there. You see him? Anyways, man, y'all see him go by my car real quick. Y'all can see that shit. Yeah, you gonna see it real quick. Let's see it. Yeah, you saw him? The speed by. <laughs> so anyways, man. We gonna have fun, man. 
and uh, it's gonna be on and popping. So, anyways, man, I salute y'all. Thank y'all. I love y'all. Adrian Broner, be Adrian Broner. You got a fight coming up. This won't be the last time he promotes himself, but he just stole Keith Thurman's thunder. Now people ain't talking about Keith Thurman. Can he come back? It's like, damn, can he beat Adrian Broner? Adrian Broner calls him out, right? It's an interesting fight. That is an interesting fight because we've seen an overconfident Keith Thurman lose. And honestly, in my humble opinion, I swear to God, this is the, Adrian Broner hasn't gotten in any trouble this offseason. All right, he's young. He's gonna spend money. He's gonna have a great time. He's gonna take care of his kids. He's gonna be. He's gonna be more talkative. I've I've grown to learn that about Adrian Broner, and I've learned that about being around young kids and myself actually being young. So I so I I, I don't read into that. You, you know, as it relates. I, I, I just hope and pray that in addition to him partying and having a great time, he's making great investments. You know, I'm always going to be on Adrian Brown. He reminds me of one of my students. Just like Shakur Stevenson reminds me of one of my sons. I'm not one. I only have one son. What the fuck I'm talking about? <laughs> he reminds me of my son. You know what I mean? So anyways, man, Barbershop Conversations. A.B. All about business. <laughs> Athletic bastard. All about billions. He's back. He wasn't drinking Saturday night. He was, his eyes was clear. I'm serious. I'm, I'm being as real as I can be. He was clear. Keith Thurman. I, I want to hear Keith Thurman respond. He probably won't respond. He's probably he's probably going on vacation. He ain't even thinking about it, man. He like, how the fuck did I lose? But his paycheck is great. So barbershop conversations, man. Feel free to hit the subscribe button. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.